Good evening from Northern California and Oakland. I'm Matt Cohen. Great to be joined by Jay Williams. Jay, Oracle Arena, oldest building in the league. Crazy to think this is its final season. And Ed, if I know these fans and I know this team, they're going out with a bang. Good luck walking out of Oracle with a dub in Dub Nation. They've had a lot to cheer about in recent years. Let's get ready for this one. The Sacramento Kings control the tip. To Heald. Barnes. Finish that. Curry to bring it up. Looking to make something happen. Curling inside, yes, and the foul, and a chance at three coming up. Ed, you ever bail out of something at the last second? That's what I saw right there from the defender. We call that no man's land. They weren't really committed to getting out of the way, committing a hard foul, or taking the brunt of the contact. Free throw up and good. It's a three-point play on the first possession of the game. Joseph with it. He'll run the offense to Harrison Barnes. Nice pass to get things going. That's lunch pail business right there. Don't worry about the no call. Keep powering through. For three. It's Aiden with the rebound. DeAndre Ayton to Barnes. Harrison Barnes powers it through. Ed, do you remember that 2015 NBA championship team for the Golden State Warriors? Klay Thompson, Stephen Curry, that old school squad, Maurice Spates, Andrew Bogut, Festus Azili, and how about Harrison Barnes? Remember that guy that was one of the best two-way players in the league at that given time? All before the move was made by the Warriors, where they traded him to Dallas just so they can make room for the next step to get Kevin Durant. And the rest is history. Curry. From long range. Yes. Give the advantage to the shooter. C to three, B to the three. Some young players look like deer in headlights out there on the court. But you, you got something different. You got that moxie. Knocked loose. And that's going to get out of bounds. Kings retain the possession. It's a turnover as they head the other way. Driving right to the basket. Flushes it home. Woo! This rookie is a high flyer. He brings that kind of pro-am vibe to the NBA. And it's fun to watch. Games with the ball. Probing the defense to Harrison Barnes. Beyond the arc for three. Buries it on the catch and shoot. I don't know how he saw his man out in the cut like that, but that was nice. To Thompson. The pass stolen by Sacramento. Play Thompson. Oh, oh, and he can't keep it in off the block. Man, that was impressive. Draymond Green with the block. That's me, I got ball. He was smothered and still gets it to go down. Corey Joseph, tough matchup with Draymond Green. Final shot of the period, almost. It would have counted, but no good. Time's run out here in the first quarter. One quarter in the book. 
has the potential to be a good one. Yeah, both teams have came out. They play with great energy, and they've also done an excellent job of establishing their own tempo. They have to make sure they have to push through that and do more of that in the second quarter. Count it, and the foul. He is going to the line for a free throw. People become so fixated on the hands or the arms or the strengths of the arms. I look at the legs. The strength of his legs help him power through that play. That's how you get and ones. Free throw good as he completes the three-point play. The lead is up to six. It's the Kings now with the ball. To Barnes. Harrison Barnes. He's two for two now. Attack mode isn't a switch that you can just turn on and off. He needs to do more of that. We need to see him penetrate, get into that lane, and create. To Green. Harry Giles snatching it out of the air. Just incredible timing on that swap. Wow, look at him die for the loose ball. Knocks it down from mid-range. I'm not sure that wasn't an offensive foul, but take it when you can get it. Joseph with it. Down six. To healed. Possession lies with Golden State. Stuffs it down with authority. Showing you why he belongs here in this league with the best of the best. Efficient scoring out of the rookie here tonight. Joseph with it. Margins eight. Right down the lane, but the shot won't go. The crossover gets inside and the slam dunk. He was ready right at the tip. What a first half he's having. He came out out of the gate, attacked, found ways to get to the rim. Now look how easy the game is coming to him. Joseph with it, trailing by 10. To Harrison Barnes. Knock loose. That's a turnover. It goes the other way. Come on, let's dig in. Let's really build this lead. Curry. Wide open look won't go. I don't know why he rushed that shot. He was wide open. Take your time. Knock loose. Barnes. Deep two there. Won't go. Emphatic slam. That's called a grown man play, Ed. Someone's trying to get featured on Sports Center tonight. It's Sacramento hey, ball. Up, Corey Joseph, up. defended by Steph Curry. Willie Cauley Stein. Huge block. Couldn't keep it in. Out off Willie Cauley Stein. Buddy Heald. On your right, on your right. You're up. You're up. DeAndre Ayton to Barnes. Right, Let's that. it fly from long range. That won't go. Yes, and a foul. He'll have a chance at a three-point play. And I know there's so much excitement about the play, but everybody looks at the player. More people need to pay attention to the guy at the end of the bench, the strength and conditioning coach, because this kid's been putting in the time and effort every day in the weight room. Free throw, good. A three-point play as they move in front here just before the break. Here comes the screen. A very one-sided first half of basketball as we are at halftime. Let's get you to Orlando where we say hello to Jalen Rose. The Warriors absolutely dominated the competition in the first half. It was their playmaking, the way they gave each other scoring opportunities. That really impresses me. 
I love seeing unselfish basketball like that. And first half, very one-sided. What will the second half bring? We'll find out as we're underway. Curry with the basketball. The lead is 15. That one's going to be out of bounds. To Harrison Barnes. Gets a look. Can't hit. He throws it down. I know there's that old saying that says one man can't beat five, but we're watching one man carry four other players. His back has to be hurting. Another big time finish. Off the mark. He loves the tough shots, but that one may be too tough. Kings have the basketball. Split the D there, but he can't get it to drop. Oh, ferocious slam inside. Man, they are just continuing to pour it on. But the one thing we know about in this league, you have to make sure that you continue to play with energy because leads can evaporate quickly. Willie Cauley-Stein rejects it. Buddy healed. Two minutes left in the third quarter. Fires the three. Too easy. Defense has to communicate. But it was how he created the shot. As a defender, there's a tendency to stand up when you stare at the ball. Offensive player recognized that, continuously moved without the ball. Bang, that's how he set it up. Joseph with it. His guy's down big. To Barnes. Baseline drive. Harrison Barnes. Oh, three for eight. He's got to do better. The one thing we know for certain in this league, it doesn't matter how big the margin is, you can always put together a run and get back in this one. And count the basket. You normally don't see that, but that's the type of thing that keeps shooters in the league for a long time. Every once in a while, they venture into the paint. Knock loose. Draymond Green, able to... Whoa! Get that out of here! Message sent, Jay. Blocking so many shots only gives your perimeter that much more confidence to really apply more pressure. Buddy healed. Corey Joseph matched up with the two-time MVP. Knocked loose. Warriors come up with it. Yes, Clay Thompson. Better late than ever. That was his first shot, and it goes down. And if you're on defense on that last possession, no need to look over to the coach's bench, hold up your arms, wonder what did you do. Everybody got back. Everybody communicated. Everybody pointed. It was just better offense than it was defense. Yes, and the foul, and a chance at three coming up. And I love the smile on the face of the offensive player. Sometimes luck is on your side. I don't know how that shot went in, but and one. Free throws good as they continue to widen their lead. Joseph with it. They can get a two for one if they hurt it. Down low for Barnes. Ah, the monster stuff. An easy two. Get back on defense. Barnes. Screen coming your way. Screen coming your way. To heal. Five on the shot clock for Sacramento. Open look, and he buries it. Defense has to wake up. Just inside the arc. At the buzzer. Three quarters down. The Warriors with a commanding lead. 
the Kings have had the basketball as we begin the fourth quarter. They're looking up at a big margin, and that, Jay, shouldn't come as a surprise to many. Well, for them to have a chance to win, I'm glad they brought their A game in their backpacks here to the arena, but that's not enough. They need their A-plus game, and they need to execute down the stretch. You need to throw everything in the bag at them in order to win this game. Not enough touch. Harrison Barnes misses. And big-time coaching strategy throws it down off the alley-oop pass. Jay, that's been the story this evening. I mean, another one? Another dunk? Another easy possession? I mean, how demoralizing can this be for the team? Why am I the only one yelling? I don't see anybody on the bench yelling. I don't see anybody on the court even angry right now. Joseph with it. Down a bundle. To Heald. Knocked loose. Buddy Heald. Barnes. The jumper's off the mark. Here's Curry with it up top. Looking to make something happen. To Harrison Barnes. Oh, he sent that one to the third row. He was locked in. That was impressive. Yes, and a foul. He'll have a chance at a three-point play. Oh, he should get some kind of acting award. That's a great sell by the offensive player. But guess what? The refs bit, and that's the game. One more to the total. This game feels out of reach. Sacramento ball. My ball, my ball. To Barnes. Yep, yep. Knocked loose. It's a turnover as they head the other way. Let's just let the clock run out. We got to get out of here. I got a dinner to go to. Stephen Curry right, with a look. Joseph with it. He'll run the offense. Willie Cauley-Stein sends it away fourth this contest you know why i don't see anybody on the defensive end standing up out of position i see everybody squatted down really active with their hands that's the mentality that will lead you to where you want to go throws it up draymond green it's been a quiet night only three attempts but he makes that one stick in the paint you need to finish just like that Trying to cash in, and that's rebounded by Golden State. End to end on that one. 94 feet for the basket. It can only be one of two things here. One, the defender ran out of gas. Or two, this dude is just unstoppable. Curry gets a shot up off the mark on the follow way to stay with it great job using that shoulder to create contact with the defender without hesitation to heels they work it down to barnes draymond green pins it here's one of the biggest secrets as we move into this new age of basketball especially in the draft room you have to draft players with size and length that's the biggest deterrent for any team offensively to Thompson. <laughs> to Green. Fires the three. Rebound for Aiden. Corey Joseph takes aim at Steph Curry. Barnes. And the rebound taken by the Warriors. Yes, Clay Thompson. Not a busy night, but effective. Two for two. It's the Warriors who get the victory as they win this one in blowout fashion for Jay Williams and all our crew. The Warriors were merciless in this game. They did it with blocks and they did it with steals. More to the point, they did it with excellent defense.